Hello my friends, this is Michael with the Whoopnik channel. Today I will be showing you how to clean the filter of the Dyson V15 Detect. This here is the filter in question. In order to remove it from the V15, just turn it left and it will come out easily. Ooh, look at this. This filter really needs to be cleaned. Really. A word of caution. This here is the original Dyson filter, which is dirty. It needs to be cleaned under, under the tap water, under the faucet. And you have to leave it dry for at least 24 hours. It must be bone dry before you put it back into the uh, vacuum cleaner. In order to avoid that, just buy a second one. Yeah, this here is a uh, new clean and bone dry uh, filter. You just put it into your Dyson V15 while the other filter is drying. The original Dyson filter cost $30. This here is a no-name filter and I got two of these for $15 on Amazon. Compared to the original Amazon filter, the no-name filter feels kind of cheap. Yeah, here the uh, filter itself is thinner than the filter in the original Dyson and it doesn't fit that well. When I put here the uh, no name in, it is, yeah, no, it's, it will eventually fit, but it doesn't have the same snug fit than the original Dyson. Yeah, it doesn't fit right. Now I'd put in the Dyson. Ah, much better. It feels much better to put an original Dyson filter into your V15. Here is a filter in question. Yeah, still dirty. Let's wash it with cold water. Put it to cold. Let it run a little bit. And then just gently like this. Yeah, build a cup, close the uh, uh, bottom hole and shake it. When the water is clear, running out of the uh, filter, then you are done. The filter is clean. Let's do it again. Wonderful. Now, doesn't it look great? All clean. Very clean. Now I'm placing here the filter and let it dry please, let it dry for 24 hours minimum. It must be bone dry before you put it back into your Dyson V15. Now 24 hours later, the filter is bone dry. Yeah, nice, really dry. Look at it, it is dry and clean. My friends, the filter is clean, as you can see here, wonderful, bone dry. This is the uh, term, it must be bone dry or else you might lose warranty and or destroy uh, your wonderful Dyson V15. Now just reinsert the filter into your Dyson V15 and you turn it now right and click, there it is. Looks wonderful. Now the Dyson V15 has a brand new filter. Works great. I prefer original Dyson products. They are a little bit more expensive, but the whole vacuum cleaner was expensive. So why would you put into this uh, wonderful and expensive vacuum cleaner uh, cheap filters? Don't do it. Don't buy uh, some of these Amazon filters. Buy original Dyson. 
My friends, that's it for today. I'm logging off. I'm closing down. I hope you liked my little video here. Please don't forget to subscribe and to like my video. I will see you next in one of my next videos. Have a great and wonderful day. I will see you. And please stay positive.